Hey guys, it's me, Ty, and welcome back to another video. Today, we are today going to be playing something we have not done yet on the channel, which is play... Well, technically, we have played the fan game before. We have played 5 minutes of Freeze fan games before, but we are going to be doing a different type of fan game. Today, we are going to be playing Pokemon Infinite Fusion, a new popular, very, very popular fan game that I really want to try out with you guys here today on the channel. So we're going to make a, a new series playing this awesome, unique, um, kind of really creative um, fan game that really takes um, all the unique ideas of the community to the next level. Um, if you don't understand how this works, hopefully, I'm pretty sure this will probably tell us how this works. I've never played this before. You guys have never played this, hopefully, before. Maybe you've seen some about it. But, um, let's get into this. So, Silco is now proud to announce the new product that will revolutionize Pokemon Battle. Introducing DNA Splicers. That's the thing that they use with Kiram, isn't it? This revolutionary new device extracts the DNA of two Pokemon and combines them to create an entirely new species. There's a Gengar. And then the Reno. Select any two Pokemon, use your DNA splicers on them, and just watch the magic happen before your eyes. Oh wow! A fused Pokemon learns moves from both halves, which gives him an edge over regular Pokemon. And you can now try it on your very own Pokemon. DNA Splice is now available for purchase at every Pokemon. It's just literally an advertisement. Pokemon Infinite Fusion. That's it. <laughs> Look at that funny looking Rattata bird thing. But yeah, this is a really unique looking fan game. I'm really excited to uh, play this one. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe. And if you guys enjoy this series on this game, this fun looking fan game, I hope you guys do and leave comments down below of what you think um, of this fan game. And I don't know, maybe if there's some cool fusions that you've seen that you want to show me, just uh, let me know down in the comments below and maybe in future videos I'll try to fuse those two Pokemon together to see what cool creations we can make. But let's do this. Obviously we have barely even started. It looks like we got a Wii here. Oh, it's a PS5. <laughs> Take that, Nintendo. Oh, no. Oh, I don't think you could say that to the Nintendo God. Uh, very good going. Okay, we're in a rush, it seems. But look, we got a dumbbell up here. I guess we're lifting weights. Okay, another bed. Can we lay down? No. Ah, uh, it's a very comfy bed. Okay, we can go downstairs, I guess. Hi. We received a letter for you. It's from the Pokemon League. Pokemon League, oh god. Here, open it. Dear Ty, we are pre pleased to announce that your Pokemon League application has been accepted. You are hereby recognized as an official Pokemon trainer. You can now earn badges and take part in the Pokemon League challenge. You will find your trainer card attached to this letter. We wish you the best of luck. The Pokemon League Am Admission Board. Nice! Okay, we got our trainer card. So what did I say? They accepted your Pokemon Trainer application? Ty, that's amazing. I'm so proud of you. Oh, isn't that boy next door receiving his Pokemon today as well? I overheard Coach Dresser Oak talking about it. Hmm, what's the name of the everyone calls him? Oh, our rival. Oh, we could just name him Blue. Uh, hmm, rival. I guess we could just stick with Blue. I can't really think of a better name what that character's name technically is, so I can't really complain. Yup, okay. Well, that's it, dear. I'm not holding you here any longer, so go off on your adventure. Okay. Who is this person? Why is the, the female protagonist uh, here? The female version of our character. Awesome. Okay, I guess they're just emotional support. Oh, oh gosh. Guess who just got accepted as official Pokemon trainer? That's right, me. Oh, you got layer 2? I'm surprised they let you in. I guess they had higher standards. 
I guess there's no point in bragging about mine now then. Anyway, Gramps told me he's gonna give me my first Pokemon. He went to Viridian City and run a standard errand, but he told me to wait for him at the lab. See ya. This sprite looks a bit- his little body sprite looks a bit bigger than ours. I don't know why. But obviously the art style definitely seems a bit more reminiscent of like Gen 4. Which is okay. Is there that or Gen 5? I'm not really sure. I haven't seen more Gen 4 in this, but, um, obviously this is taking pl place in the Kanto game, so it's gonna have a lot of the Gen 1, uh, story included, but it seems that it still has a lot of differences from, from the originals. Uh, this is Blab, right? Yep, okay, so I'm guessing we go in here to get our first Pokemon. Okay, we just immediately go in there, okay. Hello. You waiting on it? Oh, we can just take our Pokemon. Oh, we gotta wait for him. Okay. I'm guessing we gotta go somewhere. Pallet Town. Oh, oh this is a uh, family. Oh, okay. Can we live in Town Map? Thank you. Can you give me something? Okay, never mind. I'm guessing we want to go out here then? Oh, careful, I stopped you just in time. There are hostile Pokemon that way. It's dangerous to go without a Pokemon. Speaking of which, I almost forgot. Isn't today the day you're supposed to receive your first Pokemon? Come, follow me to my lab. I'll find Barrett. We better talk there. Oh gosh, we're right there. Okay. <laughs> uh, it's time for you two to set on your journey. Um, set out on your journey. Uh, go and grab your Pokemon off the table. No fair. Why does Ty always get to pick first? Go get one too, Blue. Be patient. Oh, okay. So I'm guessing these are just the basic Kanto starters? Charmander. No. Uh... Oh, I don't know. I haven't played a whole lot of the Kanto games compared to any other generation, which is kind of surprising. Because I don't play Pokemon fan games as often as a lot of others, but... Um... Huh, I don't know. I've always been a huge fan of Squirtle. I've always liked him a bit more than the others of oh, Kanto starters. So I think I'll choose Squirtle. Yeah, my little turtle friend. There's a little fun fact about me. Turtles are actually my favorite animals, so this is kind of perfect. Yeah, let's give them a nickname. What do we name you? Uh-huh. What do we name my friend? What do we name Squirtle? Hmm. Actually, I'm pretty sure the Pokemon fusions have their own unique name. So if we fuse our Scarlet with something, it'll get a unique name. So... We'll just need leave it to Squirtle. Well, Gramps got me one of those new DNA splicer and they're talking about TV, so I guess I'll take the other two. Wait, he gets to fuse both of them? Oh, wait, he gets a Charizard and Venusaur? Oh, God. They're, they're combined, though? Isn't that gonna be, like, overpowered? Oh. Oh, he's gonna battle me. Oh god. This is cool. I like this. Yeah, I like the the fresh Oh god. I don't know if I like it or not. Uh it's probably both fire and grass type. That's not good for us. It's faster. Uh-oh. I like its name, Charsaur. That's fun. Growl. Uh oh. It's just spamming growl. Keep hitting it. There we go. We got a crit. Good job. Woo! Yeah, that's gotta be worth a level. That's literally a few Pokemon. Almost two levels. Oh god. This game's awesome already. I love this. I can't wait to see how many few Pokemon there are in this. I'm pretty sure there's up. Th this game has up to generation five. 
So it's from Gen 1 to Gen 5. And it, I'm guessing there's updates in the future, I don't know, but this game just seems so awesome. Okay, let's keep going. Uh, is, is there Pokemon healed? Uh, let's see. Pokemon. Yeah, we're all good. We do not have Pokeballs though. Does he want us to go get the parcel just like in the original? So. Oh, it gave us a potion. Thank you, sir. I don't have any Pokeballs, do I? Yeah, I don't got any Pokeballs. I only have that single potion in my bag. So I'm guessing we just want to go to the next town then. Maybe get a few battles with him with Pokemon. Ooh, I like this. Music is nice, I like that. Whoa! Our, our first wild fused Pokemon, a rat G? Oh gosh. I don't know if I like it or not. I don't think I like it very much. It's faster than us? I guess with the few I guess fusions combine the stats. That's kind of open. Power. Jeez, that thing actually hurt. Luckily, now we're level 7. We know Water Gun, that's awesome. Who is an item? Uh oh. We might want to run away from this guy. Okay, just a normal Pidgey. Orenberry. Okay, that's. That, I guess that's not bad. Uh oh, another Pokemon. Okay, Rattata. Oh wow, we can't run. Wait, is it faster than us? Oh. Woo! That was scary. We might want to use that potion. Because that hurt. Let's use that po- Actually, let's use the orange berry we got. There we go. There you go. Now we got some HP. That orange bear was probably not that rare either, anyway. Okay, I guess we go up here. Viridian City, okay. Oh, Pokemon's in there. Hello. I like the, that the words are red. Kinda helps di differentiate it between who's who. Oh, look at the little bell sprout. Oh, if I give him a Spearow, I can get the Bell Sprout. Ooh, that'd be cool. This game's already so cool. But we want to get our hands with some Pokeballs. So, I'm guessing we want to go get that part still. Yep, figured. Ah, oh, our first DNA Splicer. So we, I'm guessing since they said that in the beginning at the advertisement, I'm guessing that that means that we can get the Splicers by just buying them normally the Pokemon. I'm guessing since this game's all about the fusions, I'm guessing they're not that expensive. Anymore. So, yeah. Oh, dang it! <laughs> the last one! Okay. Oh, level 5 Pidgey, jeez. It'd be cool if we fuse a Pidgey with something. Pidgey's always been a fun beginner, kind of, like, Pokemon first route bird. Up on down. There we go. Let's go give it to Professor Oak. Okie dokie. We got it for you. Oh, oh Ty, how is my old Pokemon doing? Well, it seems like it likes you a lot. Okay, there's a parcel. Nice. Nice, okay, here's our Pokeballs. Just five, but that should be plenty. Pokedex, thank you. I don't know if we immediately fuse our starter with something until it's like something really good, but 
I think we should definitely try to catch two Pokemon we can use it with. So, I don't think I want to do a Rat, Rattata, and Pidgey Fusion since we already saw that. So maybe something a bit different. So like, maybe a, um, a Pidgey Fusion doesn't sound bad. It's just, I just, I don't know what other Pokemon could spawn here. We could find. Let's see what we get here. What on who Junior? Wait, who who in mine Junior? Dude, that's actually kind of cool. What? Like it's scary looking, but it's kind of cool. I kind of like it. Let's try and catch it. Let's tackle. Oh wow, that hurt. Tickle. Oh god. Okay. There's a Pokeball. Do they have ha harder catch rates because they're fused? I hope not. Doesn't seem to be. We got our first team member! It's a fused Pokemon, too. Maybe it. Can you unfuse them in this game? I'm guessing you can unfuse them. Flying Fairy's not a bad type. Seems like the Fairy types in this. Uh, who? Junior? No, I like those names. I don't think we're gonna give any nicknames to a Pokemon. We can go this way. I didn't even know that. Uh oh. Rattata. I don't think we're gonna be catching Rattata. Like, Raticate's not a bad Pokemon, but I don't know if we're going to use it. Okay, back here. Let's heal our team up. Um. I don't know if it's like modern Pokemon leveling up where you every Pokemon gets XP, but I will have to wait and figure it out. Okay. Can we buy our own things now? Oh, what's this? A Pukamuku? Wait, I didn't have a gift. Whoa. Wait, I just get a, a new Pokemon? It's a Pukamuku? Dude, that's sick! Dude, Pukamuku would be such a cool Pokemon to fuse with something. Oh, oh, look at the picture! The sprite is just them combined. Oh, that's sick. Pukamuku is such a cool Pokemon. Hello? Oh, yeah, look! Yeah, they're fairly cheap. So let's buy some Pokeballs. Let's get like six, yeah. And then let's get some DNA Splicers. Let's get two. And then maybe like two more potions. Yeah, okay, that's fair. Yeah. Keep moving. That's awesome. I didn't even know you could do that. What's this? Pokemon Academy. It's a watchtower here. What's up with that? Hello, sir. Oh, I can't get that Pokeball. What's over here? Oh wait, this is Route 22. I shouldn't go over here. A potion. Nice. I can't go down there to get that TM. Actually, I can. Yeah, I can just go down here. Okay, nice. Free TM. This early in- Oh wait, no. Oh, I need to use Surf. Uh, I don't have Surf. That's probably really far in the game. Oh, hello, ma'am. You got some crazy hair. Yeah. Hello. Oh, eight badges to get in there? Oh, yeah, that's the eighth gym. I forgot that's what's at this town. I forgot that Brox is at Pewter City. Uh, who is this building? Hello, sir. You have a terrible headache. Okay. Very interesting. I guess we keep moving. What Pokemon can we get here in Route 2? Another Rattata. 
Okay then. What's this sign say? Ah, just tips. Any cool Pokemon here? Oh, another Hoot Hoot. But we already have a really co cool fused Hoot Hoot. Okay, we go in here, and then we go to the forest. Right? My favorite bug type Pokemon is Moves Fury Cutter, of course. Ah, oh, she'll pay. I can pay her to make me learn it. That's cool. Wait, is this trash have something in it? Oh no. I was about to say, like, usually the trash cans don't have anything in it, but it looked like there's something in there. Yeah, maybe we can find Pikachu like we can normally. Oh, trainer. Oh, okay then, encounter then. Another hoot hoot. No, we're not gonna fight it. Oh, I guess that's not a trainer. They just. Ooh, Weedle, a Beedrill fusion move. Probably looks sick. Let's try to catch you. Jeez, it's fast. It's a Pokeball. This is awesome. I'm loving this game already. Nice, Weedle cut. What cool Pokemon could Weedle fuse with? Oh, I don't know. What's this? Oh, potion. That's nice. Nothing back here. Why am I going over here? A Meowth? In this area? Jeez. Oh god. The Meowth is fast. Jeez. The encounters are just come happening one after another. Uh oh. Caterpie. We already got a good bug type. Oh god. We're gonna have to kill this thing. Oh wow, water gun looks insane. Crit, nice. Some XP. It looks like only one Pokemon gets XP. Unless if we have to wait to get a um EXP share. Okay, Caterpie again. Antidote. I don't think there's really anything over here. So where do we go? Oh, this way. Of course. Another item. Jeez, there's so many items, but they're just behind patches of grass. What on earth? That's so funny! <laughs> Ooh, Pokeball. Nice. Oh, this is our first trainer battle, isn't it? Yeah. He's got cool bug Pokemon. It's probably a fused bug. Oh no, just the Caterpie. He's got a normal Pokemon. Jesus, it's level 7 though. The difficult despite in this game is so quick. At the same time though, I guess it is balanced with my already level. Boom. Here, let's try to get Hoot Jr. some XP. Hoot Jr. Oh god, that thing is interesting. Do you have any moves? It does not know any attacking moves. Okay, Squirtle. Take a hit. Or screenshot, that works too. Water gun. 
Wait, is it ground type? Is it? No, it isn't. Okay, it's a poison and bug type, I'm guessing. Nice. Copycat? Oh wow, you already know some interesting moves. Hypnosis is so good! You're a foresight. Therapy now will stand. Jeez. Oh gosh, that thing got hurt. Water got so strong. Nice job, Squirtle. Jeez, we're hurt though. Whoa, what happened to the lighting? It's so dark. Is it nighttime? Yeah, it was probably heal. Probably turn night or something, or it's supposed to be naturally dark in the here. Was this a shortcut? Ooh, shortcut. I'll take that. Or not. I guess it is. Ooh, Weedle. Okay. We already have Weedle. You can tell by the little Pokeball next to its health bar. Antidote. Okay, just another one of those casually. Oh, it's to help me get past him. Oh, or, or we just get an encounter. Caterpie, okay. There we go. We're making our way through. I haven't seen anything really unique though. Or is it Pidgey? We could fuse the Pidgey with the Pokemon. How about, yeah, let's do that. Oh, as long as this doesn't kill. Yeah, okay. Let's catch Pidgey. Nice. I think a Pidgey fusion would look pretty sick. Some XP. No. Okay, nice. She's a mother? We just moved one step. There we go. Oh, that's definitely a trainer. Meows again. I don't think I would like to see any meow fusions. I don't know if they would look very appealing. Yeah, hello. Okay then. <laughs> yeah, see, so it's just dark in that area. It's probably because the game thinks it's the afternoon. Okay. Yeah, let's definitely heal our Pokemon. Oh, the, the words aren't red this time. So how do you use the fuse item? Figure out that. Items. DNA splicers. Use. Where do you, how do you use these? Like, I'm pretty sure I think I've seen them being used in the PC. Organized use. Yes. So let's maybe fuse Pidgey with um, Pukamuku. How about that? Fuse. Fuse. Which one look cooler though? Why is this one green? Oh, green is custom, I think. Yeah, I think I read about this. So, water flying or flying water? Well, I think we know what we gotta choose. Let's do this. Our first fusion. 
Oh, this is so sick. Oh, what is it? Oh, it's actually kind of cool. Sprite by Tuan... Tu... Tu... I don't know how to say that. Tu... Tunana. Uh, well... Thanks to them for the cool sprite. This looks so cool! Dude, that was worth it. It's like a cool, like, edgy Pidgey. That's so cool. Oh, I can use this ability. Ooh. Neutral. Sure. Dude, that's sick. Dude, this is like our coolest fusion. Like, this one's cool, but oh my gosh. That's awesome. Dude, that was so worth it. Wow. That's sick. Okay. What a fusion. Nice. Let's talk to the people. They might give items. Yeah, this guy wants a Mankey, and they'll give me a Tyrogue. Let me guess, this person gives Rattata a question mark? No? Okay. Oh, cool, can you trade in this fan game? There's online trading? Ooh, move reminder. Okay, that's pretty useful. this guy fix game oh, okay he can fix the game trading a oh, wonder trade oh you can wonder trade in this game with other fan game players the people are playing this game that's that's so cool okay where's the gym leader I think we can end off the video once we beat him This it. Yup, looks like we're out it. Oh, he'll give me a flute if I beat the gym? Oh, this is not the gym. <laughs> uh, it's, a, it's probably up here then. Yes, here we are. Brock, you're going down. We have such a good team. Hello, sir. Fresh water. Nice, thank you. That's a good heal. Oh, there's trainers on either side. You have to fight one either way. Oh, it's a backpacker? I thought it was a... Look, his sprite in the overworld looks different. What is this abomination? Is that a worm version of Geodude? I kind of like it. It's, it's kind of derpy. I like it. Obviously, either rock or ground. That, that, I, dude, fusions are just the coolest thing. Level 10, nice. Withdraw. Let's get... Puku... I don't even know how to say this. Um, Puku G. Dude, it's just so sick. Oh, what? <laughs> what is that? That is the funniest thing I've ever seen. Mud sport? That might help. Electricity? Oh, that's not gonna help. Uh, maybe we switch back into Squirtle. <laughs> okay. Because Pukaji only has Tackle. We're gonna have to wait until it gets any good, like, water or electric. Not electric, but just water. Yeah, water. Oh, it's sturdy. Oh wait, because it's Geodude and, um, Sand, uh, Sandile? No, that's Sandile. How do I not remember the name? Oh, what's one salmon? Yeah, that's pretty good.
No help again. Level 6, oh wow. There we go, get some levels in. Okay, before we end the video, we're beating Brock. Do this. Oh, we have to choose what Pokemon we want to use? Uh, let's use this one, because we really like it. Yeah. Okay, you can only use two? Oh, wow. Well, that must be pretty difficult, then. He's only got two, though. Oh, God. It's a ripped Pidgey. God. It's a Giga Tad Pidgey. Rip. God, those Rock Tomb? Uh-oh. That's gotta hurt it though. Rock polish too? Uh oh, this thing's strong. But not strong enough. These levels are gonna be so useful. Let's get some levels up on Puka G. I think I'm saying it right. Oh my god! It's so weird and creepy, I don't like it. Like, the body parts being little diglets, I kind of like it. I kind of think that's funny, but I don't like the creepy onyx face. That's scary. Get rid of it. Wait, isn't this thing going to be quad weak? Yeah, nice. Nice. Woohoo! That wasn't too difficult. Premium Wonder Trade ticket. What does it mean by Premium Wonder Trade? Oh, thank you. That's very nice of you. What did it mean by Premium Wonder Trade ticket? Can we slip through here? Oh gosh, we can. Let's first heal our team. And then we'll, maybe to end it off, we figure out what does it mean by this Premium Wonder Trade ticket. Is that how you wonder trade in this game with other players? Is do you have to have these tickets? Oh, wait. Who's this guy? Oh, you could purchase them. Yeah. More rare and guaranteed to get a custom sprite. Ooh. Yeah, let's do this. Oh, we have to trade a Pokemon, though. Uh oh. Uh, dang it, I pressed the wrong button and it just showed the controls. Okay, well, maybe we'll figure out how to do that later. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of part one of playing Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Probably one of the coolest and best Pokemon fan games I've ever played personally. And like ever seen but i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next pokemon infinite fusion video good bye